guys welcome to a very 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 special vlog this is Candace's birthday vlog as you guys know Candace is my wife and pretty much the best thing that has ever happened to me Aww. we now have four beautiful children one fur baby and she just she's such a team player and I just have given her my whole heart and uh, I'm just still in disbelief that of all people on this planet, she chose me too. Um, I don't know if you guys remember from the uh, Who Are We blog. If you haven't seen it, I've linked the video below so you guys can go check it out. Um, it was in very, very early stages of our vlog, so it, uh, I don't know that we really explained our situation all that well, but long story short, neither Candace or I have ever been with a woman. We were best friends uh, for about six months, and then slowly we both realized that we had actually fallen in love with each other. Um, at, at around the same time which kind of worked in our favor but we kept our relationship a secret for six months for multiple reasons and then finally decided that um, we needed to tell people because it wasn't going away and uh, we wanted to move on with our lives so we told our families we told everybody and we've been happy and just completely head over heels for each other for the last five years so this woman is just incredibly strong and I just do not know what I would do without her. So it's a special day. I want to spoil her. I want to do all kinds of fun stuff. So join us for this awesome vlog and uh, wish her a happy birthday, guys. We'll see you on the next clip, whatever that is, because I have no idea where this vlog is going. But that's the fun part. <laughs> we'll see you guys later. It's your birthday. Yes, Woo! Woohoo! How do you feel? Um, okay. Tired? Yeah. Because these little kids, they wanted to act out last night. And so we didn't sleep much. How huh, Mister? Do either? We were supposed to go to breakfast this morning, but we s slept in. So now we're gonna go to brunch. It's your birthday! It's my birthday! Whoa! Cool! <laughs> you don't like my dented one? No. <laughs> Just don't drop that one, please. Okay, I'll try. That, um, the socks are from Mr. Oh, these are cool. It could be quizzies. So mine are black. <laughs> Kylie's don't look checkered anymore. They're all no. solid black. Oh, I love it, girls. Thank you. Fuck, you look because you always see my goat No, because we said that your purple ones don't match with much. And so now you have some that and are. Can be matches with you guys again? Yeah, now you have some that are neutral. I love it, girls. Oh, thank you, Kai. Thank you. That's the same size as yours, right? Yeah. It is. It and then is. you can just move the top. Mm -hmm. I love it. Thank you. And then I'll just use, use your really dented one. Yeah. It's had a lot of character though. <laughs> it's been through a lot. Just oh. hit it. Then it'll go back. Yeah. Thank you, girls. You like it? I love it. Thank you.
I was trying to record the pool and just try to get some footage for you and my brother and my dad just thought they were the funniest guys so with that said enjoy this next clip courtesy of my brother and my dad <laughs> just had a little moment and by a little moment I mean a little meltdown um, having triplets you know people tell you it's gonna be hard oh my gosh what are you gonna do with three babies and coming from someone who has never dealt with babies that means nothing to me now fast forward to now after dealing with a sick pregnant wife babies that were born early that spent time in the NICU, going back and forth to the hospital, and now having everybody home, and having a baby on oxygen, like, it's hard. This is the only way I was able to get them to stop. I have Alex in her carrier, and I'm holding Jordan, because they just, for the life of them, will not stop crying. But, I'm gonna be honest with you and tell you that the hardest part about all of this is just the, f the repetition of doing the exact same thing over and over and over and over again every two to three hours. And with triplets, you don't always have everybody on the same schedule, so you might be doing the exact same thing every hour or every half hour, like, it just, it's tough, so your entire day is pretty much on autopilot. So when you wake up from the autopilot and you realize, oh my gosh, I've been doing the same thing over and over and over again, 
you almost start to like panic because you're like, when does this end? Like, I, when do I get time off? When do I get to just relax and use my phone for more than 15 minutes at a time? And I mean, I can't even record this vlog without having a baby who's having a meltdown over here. But um, I, I know I'm venting a little bit, but I just wanted to share with you that this process, it's tough. And Candace and I both have been struggling because our babies are too small to just bring in a stranger to take care of them. Our families are busy. They didn't have triplets. So it's really hard to get help and to feel, to, to, to depend on other people. Not because they're not dependable people, but just because it's, you just don't want to inconvenience people in that way because at the end of the day like these are our babies and we should be taking care of them but it starts to take the toll on you and I think I've just reached a point where I am struggling pretty bad and uh, I'm finding that I'm getting more and more frustrated so I have to take a step back and just kind of take a deep breath this isn't gonna be forever this is temporary Candace helps me a lot too but Man, guys, this is this is a different thing. So if any of you guys are expecting triplets and are going to be going through this pretty soon, all I can really say is like saddle up, put your seatbelt on and get through it. I can tell you that you can get help. I mean, if you have help, that's amazing. But just know that it's going to get better and know that there's a group of us that are also dealing with these things and so we will survive it'll be tough emotionally physically and mentally but we will get there and uh it's thanks to you guys that we keep going and and we want to keep talking about these things so that you guys know what's going on and so you guys can en encourage us and we can uh get through this so Thank you for listening to my rant. I'm going to attend to these babies before they uh, make themselves sick from crying so much. So um, It's nighttime here, so I will say goodnight. And uh, until next time, bye. Oh, I feel it tonight that